What do Verna Wormgear and 15 U.S. presidents have in common? What do the fighting croutons and Mizzou sports have in common? And what does Quickie Quiz and St. Louis Cardinals baseball have in common? You guessed it. They have all been broadcast on KFRU Radio. 90 years young this year, the oldest station in central Missouri, KFRU in Columbia, actually has its origins in Oklahoma, where KFRU was based before moving. James Wood, the president of Stevens College, was looking for a station, and the private women's college bought the Oklahoma station and had the equipment shipped to Columbia in September of 1925, and they began regular broadcasting on October 7th. The call letters from Oklahoma had been retained, and President Wood reinterpreted KFRU to stand for, Kindness Flows Round About Us. The Great Depression forced Stevens to sell the station in 1932, and the new St. Louis owners would program a day that would typically include a 7.30 a.m. dance band review, the Homemaker's Corner with host Lillian Lawless at 8.45 a.m., and a 2 p.m. MU Oklahoma football game. Despite its regional coverage, on 6.30 a.m., KFRU didn't prosper. The station was sold twice again between 1935 and 1936, the second time to the St. Louis Star Times newspaper. Within a short time, they had leased a former fraternity house on the northeast corner of 9th and Elm for the station's new home. The paper went to great lengths to remodel the building and install new air-conditioned studios and began an extensive schedule of live programming. At one time, KFRU employed more than 40 entertainers, some of whom made use of an impromptu dormitory on the third floor of the station's studios. During the late 1930s, hillbilly entertainers would frequently come down to sing for the early morning shows still clad in their pajamas. With regard to the 6.30 a.m. identification, KFRU could be heard almost nationwide. In fact, for a time, all Missouri Highway Patrol cars were kept in contact via KFRU. It wasn't until 1941 that KFRU's frequency was moved to its present 1400 a.m. The station got a boost in 1940 when it won a small market George Foster Peabody Award for Outstanding Service. Malin Aldridge Jr. was a St. Louis station's news director when the Star Times tapped him to become KFRU's manager in 1945. Aldridge began energetically promoting local news, attracting the attention of Columbia Daily Tribune publisher Jack Waters Jr. And in 1948, Aldridge and Waters joined forces to buy KFRU. With the purchase, local ownership was re-established and various improvements were made, both in facilities and programming. News operations were moved in 1949 to the Columbia Tribune office. In 1950, a new studio and transmitter building located near the intersection of Business Loop 70 and Business Route 63 South was completed. KFRU's news director during the 1960s was Eric Ingberg, who had become a well-respected national CBS news correspondent. Waters' son, Hank, inherited his father's interest in the station and would buy Aldridge's interest in the station in 1983. In 1989, Waters sold KFRU to a partnership that transitioned the station to its present news talk format. And the station would change hands again in 1992 when the owners of FM station KARO in Columbia, Al Germond and David Bauer, purchased KFRU. And then in 2004, after nearly 60 years of local ownership, German and partners sold KFRU to Cumulus Broadcasting. Today, the station features local favorite programs, including Columbia Morning with David Lyle and The Morning Meeting with Simon and Renee, and has a loyal and devoted following of several generations of Boone Countyans. How many sources of news, information, and entertainment have Boone Countyans been able to turn to and count on every day for 90 years? How many things in Boone County can over the course of 10 minutes enlighten you, engage you, make you laugh, and give you something to tap your toes to? The fact is, KFRU Radio has very few peers in Central Missouri. Please welcome our friends from Cumulus Radio and KFRU into the Boone County Hall of Fame.